Connecticut's Back to School Authority is sponsored by Yale New Haven Children's Hospital, one of the best in the nation. We are your back to school authority and tonight hybrid models in class learning and virtual options can all mean scheduled disruptions for hardworking parents. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Courtney Zeller is showing us how a local camp is trying to ease the burden. There is a lot to do at the Camp Hazen YMCA in Chester. Kids are engaged, socializing and learning at the same time. So when we put that out there, um, they were just thrilled. Approved by the Office of Early Childhood, Camp Hazen YMCA is offering a new fall full day student supervision program called Camp Care starting September 1st. Kids will be able to complete their online classes while parents are at work. We'll have time that we spend on, on homework, kind of more like a supervised um, study hall type of a time. Uh, kids will have access to the internet so they can get their schoolwork done. <laughs> And don't worry, there'll be plenty of fun for the kids too. But then the other times of the day, we'll have times for lots of outdoor play, outdoor physical activity, some arts and crafts, and, and maybe some activities they won't be doing in their regular school day. Chester Public Schools chose a hybrid school model in the fall. Kids will spend three days a week online and the other two days in school. But you don't have to live in town to attend the camp. Um, and kids don't have to have been here before. We have a lot of families that have been coming to Hazen for years, um, and, we, and we have a lot of those kids that are starting to sign up, but we also have a, n a number of new families as well. This YMCA is independent from others in the state, and they're trying to do their part to help parents in this unprecedented time. We're here for our community, and we want to make sure that we're doing our part. Spots are still available. The cost is 210 for three days. Financial assistance is available. You can call the office or go on their website. We have all of that information on the Channel 3 app. In Chester, Courtney Zeller, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.